YouTube, good morning, good morning. It's your boy Cable Tech 23, man. Uh, I want to thank you guys for tuning in to another episode, Life of a Cable Technician. Starting the morning off right, uh, we got an 8 to 10 trouble call. Um, we've been having a lot of trouble calls because there was a storm that came through recently. So uh, it knocked down a lot of the drops, a lot of the uh, a lot of the uh, um, surges for the amps has been out. Um, so, um, you know, that's why we've been getting a lot of trouble calls. Um, so yeah, I won't be surprised if I go to this job and, uh, they're completely out of service, whether it's the drop at the pole or amplifier blew out or, you know what I'm saying? So we're definitely going to go out there and take a look, see what we got. Stay tuned folks, follow along with me and, uh, yeah. All right, YouTube, uh, just finished that job. Uh, it was pretty simple. I mean, I'm surprised the customer still had all the lines and uh everything else worked good except for her computer um and it was actually her computer that was causing a problem for this customer so um i told her to contact dell uh, i'm running pretty early uh so i'm gonna see if i can pre-call my 10 see if i can get there early uh which is another trouble call so uh yeah stay tuned okay folks made it to the second one second job uh customer needs their outside line to be repaired they don't have no service services are out but it's not because of a tree um customer had dick safe come out recently and uh they uh may have accidentally cut them out they're not sure but we're definitely going to get uh take a look and see uh, what we got at the top here as you can see that's the orange flag is ours red is theirs um that's the only way to find out if they cut the line to the tap if i check signal if i have signal then it's just the main feed here going into the home so okay, folks just finished reading the signal from the tap so it's definitely going to be the line, the coaxial line that's cut. So we're going to run it from the ground block here all the way back to the tap. All right. Connection here at the pedestal. All I gotta do now is make the connection at the uh, ground block and we're good to go. New ground block. New mocha filter. Nice and grounded. Alright. We look good. Alright, so we just got done with that job. Basically, it was just a temp drop that I have to run. Service up and running. They're good to go. They're happy that their services is uh, working. So, uh, yeah, on to the next one. Folks just made it to this uh, third job of the day. Um, new install. Therefore, it's going to be a new drop. Another underground. We're about to get in. It's not, we ain't, we're not going to waste any time. Um, that's the pedestal right there, the tap. And we got to run it from here all the way to over here in this corner over here temporary above there's no conduit here so we're gonna have to run the temp um, push it through that hole the customer at this job helped me out a little bit he uh, wall fished the wires inside the home for me already so we won't have to worry about doing too much wiring inside yeah, let's get to it. There. 
run the whole new drop. I mean, there is wires here already, but as you can see, um, this is just a big mess. You know, so plus all these wires are probably old. You know what I'm saying? Probably been sitting here over more than 10 years. I mean, why uh, put your signal through that? You know what I'm saying? So we're just gonna run a new, new wire here to the peg and bring the signal into the. Drop wire here. Ready to roll, baby. Wires up here. All right. Basically, what we're gonna do is, uh, like I said, we're running this temp here. We're gonna bring it through here. We're just gonna run the wire straight into the house, right through there. And dig all this, uh, all that out of there. Run it straight through. Ground it inside. Make the connections in there also. We'll be good. All right, let you guys know the outcome. All right, folks, this is the wire coming from the uh, from the outside, along with the ground wire, mocha filter here, and this is the wire that's going into the modem. All right, let you guys know how it goes. All right, peoples, just finished with that job. Took a while, man. Um, fighting with the customer's uh, modem. Uh, but anyway, uh, we ran the drop temporary drop to the home got everything hooked up customers happy that the service is working um i did end up putting a uh a ticket uh for the maintenance crew to come out the uh signal at the tap was pretty low so uh, they're gonna come out within a week to get him situated with that uh but yeah we're looking good folks uh on to the next one uh next one's a trouble call uh see you there all right folks we made it to the job down line as you see this whole tree took out the line right here for us so we uh we gotta put in some work run a new drop wire from the house all the way to the pole baby so uh let's not waste any time let's get to work uh shouldn't be shouldn't be too bad it should be pretty simple all right let's get it the house right now um what i'm gonna do here is uh basically just take the new wire and the old wire use some electrical tape take it tape it together because we still gotta go through some trees to pull the wire through like that make sure that thing nice and secure get the end damn we good now if I pull it not going nowhere nice and sturdy so when I pull the wire it should go straight through shouldn't get caught on anything no. alright so uh, I'll see you guys at the uh, at the pole. Um, all right, people, we are up here. About to get ready to pull this line. We all the way up, baby. folks pulled the wire through that's the new wire you're looking at right now uh going all the way over there got the zip ties on it bam you see the new tag let's connect it we got signal all right all i gotta do now is uh hook it up at the house uh, that's it we're good to go all right stay tuned all right guys that is it we are done here got the new wire from the pole right here going all the way up and it's going to the pole we just left so uh we are good man 
Signal's good, level's good. Then put a filter here because there's one inside already in the main splitter. So. All right, folks, I want to thank you guys for tuning in. Uh, if you enjoyed the content, please like, subscribe, share it. Um, thank you guys once again. Uh, another episode, Life of a Cable Technician. I appreciate you. Until next time, folks. Peace.